I'm Rachel Cheney. And I'm Ty Lyman. Welcome to another edition of KBFT. At this time, I'd like to remind all QSP runners to report to room 106 in order to collect your yellow envelopes. Every year, Christian Brothers welcomes new students into our school community, and this year is no different. Although most people come from around the Sacramento area, three new students took a journey from halfway around the world from Mil Milan, Italy, to join our Lasallian family. Alvin Bayani met up with these three new international students to see what they think of their trip so far. Hey CB, I'm Alvin Bayani, and I'm here to introduce to you this year's Italian exchange students, Francesco, Laura, and Maria, from Sacra Quare High School in Milan, Italy. I'm tired because we have a long, long trip on the airplane. Confused, confused, uh, confused and excited, people, quite excited. But excited, yeah. 24 hours. 24 hours. Yeah. <laughs> Too much. It's pretty long. This summer, some people of Christian Brothers came in Italy and we met them. And we started talking in English. Uh, food size. Food. Uh, you eat a lot. Everything size is bigger. Yeah, everything bigger. Cheese outside. Bigger than usual. One thing that's different is that there's people from all countries, all different countries. Yeah. We, we are Italian and we are all Italian. All Italian from the same place. We don't use to change room every classroom, yeah. uh, every class. We stay always in the same room with the same people. And teachers yeah. uh, around. Yeah. around. So the and we have, the, we have the, we have, we don't have every day the same subject. We change over there. Uh, tennis? Uh, I play soccer. And uh, water polo. Uh, it's quite hard, but people in my team, uh, they are friendly. I am no, it's fun. Yeah, it's, it's fun. fun. It's fun. Yeah. What the hell is fun? <laughs> <laughs> the, to meet different people. Yeah, meet different people. Another time. Another time. Now you know more about our new Italian friends, Francesco, Laura, and Maria. Be sure to say Benvenuto Cena. This has been Alvin Maiani reporting for KBFT, Sacramento. Class of 2012, you have a mandatory class meeting this Thursday during Falcon Flex. You will be meeting your freshman class council candidates. The election will be on Friday. If you are working on a painting for the UC Davis Children's Hospital, today is the deadline to hand it in for a chance to be on the calendar. If you don't have the painting ready, you can give it to Mr. McGovern later this week. The deadline for all paintings is, is next Monday, September 15th. If you have any questions, see Mr. McGovern in room 104. Interested in speech and debate? If so, there will be a meeting today at 3 in the library. There will be introductions, handouts, lots of good information, and an election of officers for the 2008-2009 school year. Don't miss this opportunity to gain leadership skills, possible college credit, and public speaking skills. In other club news, Communion and Liberation will meet this Thursday at lunch in room 208. All are invited. Please bring your lunch and the text. Also, there will be a mandatory meeting of the International Thespian Society on Friday when the Constitution will be adopted and the election of officer, officers will take place. For those of you who are interested in participating in the Oak Ridge Tutoring Program, La Stallion Youth will meet after school on Thursday during Falcon Flex. For those seniors who wish to be a tutor but who are not able to attend the meeting due to the senior class prayer service, please see Mr. Frescas in room 802 or Dr. Peterson in room 207. Safetyville USA is looking for volunteers to help run game booths at their annual Halloween party for the children of Sacramento. The party is on Saturday, October 25th from 10 to 4. If you're interested, please see Ms. Benedetti Emanuel in the Christian Service Center. Attention all seniors! In order to celebrate the beginning of your senior year, there will be a mandatory prayer service for the class of 09 this Thursday during the Falcon Flex period. For all you seniors interested in attending October Kairos, 
Your permission forms are due in campus ministry tomorrow. See Mrs. Nelson if you have any questions. And for those of you who have already gone on Kairos, you are invited to attend the fourth day prayer gathering this Thursday morning at 8.30 in the chapel. Attention all Frosh. If you, the Frosh, retreat this Friday, your permission forms are due to Miss Green today. If your retreat date is set for Tuesday, September 16th, your permission forms are due to Mr. Sir by Friday the 12th. The Cystic Fibrosis Foundation is looking for 10 volunteers to help at the 2008 Speeding to a Cure event from 9 to 3 this Sunday at the All-American Speedway at the Placer County Fairgrounds in Roseville. Please see Mr. Benedetti Emanuel in the Christian Service Center if you are interested. Every QSP order you turn in, you get a coin. Coins to buy prizes. We have prizes that can be bought with coins, so keep your coins to buy prizes. One coin gets you Airheads. Two coins get you Gobstoppers or Sweet Tarts. Four coins get you Reese's, Kit Kat, Twix, Red Vines, Tattoo Arms. Six coins get out of phone excuse or BMX ticket. Ten, Ultimate TV Control. Fifteen, Swirly Mug. Vinte, iPod, MP3 speakers. Thirty-five, a Sheckler t-shirt. Fifty, OGO hat. Seventy-five, Etni shoes, Plan B deck. Eighty-five, mini fridge and inflatable couch bed. One hundred, kicker speakers. One hundred twenty-five, fat head. And one hundred and fifty coins will get you the IK five hundred speakers. So remember, for every QSB order, you get a coin. Coins to buy prizes. We have prizes that can be bought with these coins. So keep your coins to get these prizes. Congratulations to the following students who sold their artwork at the wine tasting art exhibit. Sean Dunstan, Hunter Fedorenko, Anthony Castaneda, Natalie Hastings, Andrew Meyer, and Dylan Fuller. The art department would like to thank all the artists who submitted to the show, and also everyone who helped put the show together. A special thank you goes out to Alberto Davalos and Nick Leathers for all their hard work. All students who want to work on the technical crews for the fall show, there will be an organizational meeting after school tomorrow. All who are interested are encouraged to attend. The deadline to register for the October 4th SAT is today. Go to collegeboard.com to register. Don't delay. Also, this Wednesday, September 10th, Drexel University representatives will be at the Arden Hills Resort Club and Spa from 6.30 to 9 p.m. See the website below to register. Colleges such as Colgate and Boise University will be visiting after the week as well. See the Daily Bulletin for specifics. Applications for the Frank H. Buck Scholarship are available through November 12, 2008. The scholarship is awarded annually to students who have a strong interest in their school community. Applications are available at buckfoundation.org. The deadline is November 12th. Tomorrow night is college night. It's hosted here at CB at 7. Don't forget to bring your college planning binders. Sarah Wilson here with a, yet another edition of KBFT Sports. First of all, congratulations to our men's water polo team. Last weekend, our boys became the first in school history to bring home some water polo hardware. Congratulations, guys. Well, none of our fall sports teams were in action yesterday, so let's start things off with upcoming games. Our women's tennis team will play McClatchy today, fighting for their third straight win. Good luck, ladies. Tomorrow, men's soccer, women's volleyball, cross country, and men's water polo will be competing. Soccer heads off to Rio Americano to face off those Raiders. Women's volleyball will travel to Davis to battle those Blue Devils and continue their winning streak. Cross country hits El Dorado Hills and the Sierra Valley Conference. Men's water polo has two games ahead of them, playing Bella Vista and Bear Creek. Good luck to all of our teams and go get them. That's it for sports today. Well, that's all we have for you today, CB. We hope that you enjoy the rest of your week, and we'll see you again on Friday. Remember to keep selling QSP. Have a terrific Tuesday, and remember today is the A, B, G, C, E, D, F schedule.